solve for x. x divided by x plus 1 all square plus x divided by x minus 1 all square is equal to 6. Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In today's class, we want to find the value of x from this given equation. x divided by x plus 1 all square plus x divided by x minus 1 all square is equal to 6. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And to my all returning subscribers, I want to say a big thanks to you. Solution. We have the given equation. S divided by S plus 1 all square plus X divided by S minus 1 all square is equal to 6. Remember, if you have A square plus b square is equal to what a plus b all square minus 2 a b therefore our equation become we have x divided by s plus 1 plus s divided by s minus 1 all square minus 2 multiplied by S divided by S plus 1 multiplied by S divided by S minus 1 is equal to 6. Then we have this. The SM is what? S plus 1 multiplied by S minus 1. Then we have the numerator as s into what s minus 1 plus s into what s plus 1 all square minus 2 into the sm is what s plus 1 multiplied by s minus 1 and numerator will be what s and says that is s square Is equal to 6 now from here we have this let's open the bracket s times s that is s square minus a times 1 that is s plus s times s s square plus s times 1 that is s divided by s square minus 1 then minus this one two times s square that is two s square divided by s square minus one is equal to what six now we have this one we cancel this then we are left with s square plus s square that is sorry here is all square then this one will be what S square plus S square that is two S square divided by S square minus one all square minus two S square divided by S square minus one equal to six. Let 2 s square divided by s square minus 1 is equal to what? y. Therefore, we have y square minus y is equal to 6. Then we have y square minus y minus 6 is equal to zero this is a quadratic equation now let's solve this by factorization method we look for two numbers so that the product we give minus six and the sum will be what minus one then we have y square minus three y plus two y minus six is equal to what zero then we have y into y minus three plus 2 into 
y minus 3 equal to 0, y plus 2 multiplied by y minus 3 equal to 0, then we have y plus 2 equal to 0, therefore y is equal to minus 2 or y minus 3 equal to 0, therefore y is equal to 3. The two values of y are y is equal to what? Minus 2 and 3. But remember that we said 2a square divided by a square minus 1 is equal to what? y. And y is equal to minus 2 and 3. Then, then we have 2a square divided by a square minus 1 is equal to minus 2 or 2a square divided by a square minus 1 is equal to 3. Now let's solve for this. Then we have 2 a square divided by a square minus 1 is equal to minus 2. Let's cross multiply. We have 2 a square is equal to minus 2 into a square minus 1. Then we have 2 a square is equal to minus 2 times a square. That is minus 2 a square. Then minus 2 times minus 1 will be plus 2. Then we have 2 a square plus 2 a square is equal to what? 2. Now, 2a squared plus 2a squared, that is 4a squared is equal to what? 2. Now divide both sides by 4. This one divided by 4. This one divided by 4. This one will cancel this. 2 here 1, 2 here 2. Now we have a squared is equal to 1 over 2. Now s is now equal to plus or minus square root of what? 1 divided by 2. Therefore, our final answer is S is equal to plus or minus 1 divided by square root of 2. That is the first value of X. Then, let's solve for the second value of X. At Y equal to 3, we have 2X square divided by X square minus 1 is equal to 3. Now, let's cross multiply. We have 2a square is equal to 3 multiplied by a square minus 1. Then we have 2a square is equal to 3 times a square, that is 3a square minus 3 times 1, that is 3. Then we have 2a square minus 3a square is equal to minus 3. 2s square minus 3s square, this is minus s square is equal to minus 3. Now, s square is now equal to what? 3. Therefore, s is equal to plus or minus square root of 3. That is the second value of x. Now, the value of x are s is equal to plus or minus 1 divided by square root of 2, comma, plus or minus square root of 3. That is the value of x. If you have enjoyed the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. That